Sea views on every side. Two steep climbs, two long ridges and one hidden path. This is Drone and Phone. Welcome to Drone and Phone. It's the last in the recommended walks and we're going back to a walk that is very similar to the first in this particular series. This time starting in Discovery Bay that you can see there behind me and going over to Muiwo across a ridge and then across some uncharted territory. Let's see how it goes. It's frustrating, but the network of paths in the northeast of Lanto are not joined to the paths on the rest of the island. In this episode, we seek to find a path to bridge the gap. Starting in Discovery Bay, we climbed the hill behind Greenbelt Court, taking the shortest route up to the ridge. Once we hit the path, we turned left and slowly made our way to the viewing point above. From there, an easy trail took us down to the golf course before reaching the pavilion at Apo Long. Following the purple ribbons, we bushwhacked through a small forest and up a steep incline to Sam Shan Toy, where we once again bore left towards Sunset Peak. Before reaching the incline, we took one final left turn down to Moi Wo. Almost as soon as you leave Discovery Bay, the paths open up to short scrubland. It's a tough start to the day, but with magnificent views in all directions. Okay, let me describe the walk so far. We started down in Discovery Bay down here, and then slowly made our way up onto this ridge. There's plenty of paths up here. We took the one that went up the easiest, uh, and then quite a hard climb all the way up here. If I turn around over here, you can see where we're going. We're going to continue along this path down here, and that mountain behind is Sunset Peak. Now, we need to be able to get down to the valley there. Now, there's a path off to Mariwo. We're not going to do that. We're going to try and find a way up to the ridge up there uh, and onto the paths around Sunset Peak and make our way back down from there. Once you reach the lookout, the walk down to the golf course is easy to follow. It's exposed though, so come prepared if it's a hot day. After the golf course, you continue to drop below the tree line and into thick forest. Well, we've done about 5k so far and we're just coming down to a point where the map runs out. If I just switch my uh, camera around, let me show you. So here we reach a pavilion. Now, if I'm looking on my map here, I can either go left down to Moiwo or right to Tung Chung. But actually, if I come down here, you're going to see there's a third path that's not marked on the map that should take us over to the other set of paths uh, over the Sunset Peak and Lantau Peak uh, and allow us to continue on the walk. So here is the unmarked path. And we're going to see how far it takes us. The next section is tricky. The path starts to disappear and the purple ribbons are infrequent. Try to follow the power lines to the two poles at the top of the hill. From there the path gets easier to follow down to a stream, then up an incline. Once you break the tree line, the task in front of you opens up. It's a long steep climb to the top of the ridge. The final section of the walk is along well-maintained paths. First a traverse across the ridge and then a long slow descent into Muiwo. Well, I'm just coming into Muiwo. It's going to be about 14, 15 kilometers in total by the time I'm finished, but by no means an easy walk. This is serious walking, two very steep climbs going up and then going dropping right the way down. And then the second climb about 700 meters up a very steep incline. But fantastic views across East Lantau and a very enjoyable day. Now, if you like this show and you never want to miss an episode, please like our Facebook page on facebook.com forward slash drone and phone. You'll find our previous episodes nicely catalogued on droneandphone.com, our interactive map, and on our YouTube channel. My name's DJ Clark, and this is Drone and Phone. So DJ took the taxi to get here, and he's now pretending that he's been up a hill. He had a helicopter to take him to the top. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's all camera trickery. <laughs>